thanks for rejoining me on Problem Solver 35 Part 2. When we left off, we were talking that we found out that Enid was the swimmer. At that clue, we talked about Arnie also loving water. So since he's not the swimmer, Arnie must be our surfer, which tells me that none of the other participants are surfers and that Arnie doesn't do any other sport. I'm going to continue on, and it tells me that Jack likes cold weather sports the best. Well, let's take a look. Jack has two sports left. He could skateboard or ice skate. Well, skateboarding is done outdoors, so it probably needs to be a warm weather. So he's probably not the skateboarder. He must be the ice skater. That means nobody else is ice skating in the family, and Jack isn't participating in any other activities. I also see that Renee is left to be the skateboarder because it includes balance. So we're going to give her a smiley face there and cross off all the other skateboarding. We're doing a really good job with this puzzle. Let's continue. Renee wears knee pads. So we looked at Renee. Does a skateboarder wear knee pads? Well, yes, a skateboarder does wear knee pads. And Paula always wears her cap backwards. So Paula is left with football or softball. If you wore your cap or helmet on backwards in football, you wouldn't be able to see. Therefore, Paula must be the softball player, which makes sense. They wear baseball caps. Leaves us with Stephen being the football player. At this point, I have my entire matrix filled in. I, as a good mathematician, of course I'm going to go back and check all of my clues with my solutions. I'm going to give you a little bit of time to do that at this point. Hopefully you have time to check your clue with your work. We can now fill in our solutions to our corresponding sentence. So we know that Stephen plays football. Arnie plays, well, plays doesn't really go with surfing, but you would probably adjust that sentence accordingly. Renee is skateboarding. Again, plays skateboarding doesn't really make sense, so your sentence should be adjusted accordingly. Paula is the softball player. Jack does ice skating. Please adjust your sentence. And finally, Enid is the swimmer. This concludes our work on Problem Solver 35, Logical Reasoning. At this time, this video will conclude and you'll be able to either try number 36 on your own or watch us as we can perform problem number 36. I strongly recommend you try it on your own and if you get stuck or have any problems then pick up with problem solver 36 tutorial and follow along. I look forward to seeing you in class and seeing how things went.